Hello my creepy crawlies and welcome to another edition of Digging Deeper, the vlog about everything that makes my dark little heart happy. I'm DL Memphis, your mildly psychotic retro glamour ghoul. Today I received a special gift in the mail. A fan sent me a little trinket from Sweet Romance the maker and designer of the new line of Elvira, Mistress of the Dark Jewelry. And I'm about to unbox my first, hopefully not my last, but my first item. Everybody knows that Elvira recently re-emerged on the scene and bigger than ever. And sadly this year announced her retirement from the Knoxbury Farm and just the Halloween gigs that she's been doing. Now, with the announcement of her retirement and her re resurgence of popularity, she's also come out with lines of clothing, perfume, makeup, and jewelry. So we're all going to benefit, although we're all brokenhearted. Recently, Sweet Romance Jewelry announced that they were going to release a line of Elvira-inspired products and jewelry. And of course, a girl like me can't have enough creepy, crawly, wonderful, gothic, retro jewelry. So I had to have some. I am one of the lucky ladies to receive the Elvira ring. This ring was designed specifically using the ring that the Queen of Horror herself wears since her inception in every photograph ever, ever, ever of her. I'm going to start by saying, like most girls, I love a good package. And this one has Elvira's face and leopard. You can't go wrong here. The ring itself, I'm going to take this out of the box just so I can kind of tell you a little bit about the weight. Oh wow. This is this is heavy. It's a large, nicely mounted stone. Um, gorgeous. I mean, it's a beautiful ring. Usually when you order a replica ring and you get something like this, it feels very lightweight. It feels cheap. It feels hollow. It feels plastic. Not this. This is a good weight. So the ring is 14 karat gold plated. It is a red crystal and this is a very deep cut. If you look into this you can actually see the facets. This is not the normal piece of plastic or glass that you would get. The craftsmanship is beautifully done. Um, Sweet Romance Jewelry states that their products are handcrafted and hand designed and somebody put a lot of work and love into this one. No Elvira costume or cosplay would be complete without this ring. You can go online today and order a cheap replica, a plastic piece of junk to wear on your finger, but if you really want to channel the Mistress of the Dark herself, you need something like this. You can order this ring from Sweet Romance Jewelry for about $50 online. And for someone like me who likes their costume jewelry with a little bit of oomph, that's not a bad price. And this is a great product. I will definitely add something like this to my everyday wardrobe because I really do want to be Elvira when I grow up. That's it for another edition of Digging Deeper. If you like what you saw, be sure and subscribe and like this video. Otherwise, what's left of you won't fit in this little box. Until next time, pleasant spring. I guess he liked it because he put a ring on it. I don't know that's all. And this one time at Comic-Con, when I stalked Elvira, I got this to show for it. I'm ready for my close-up. Ow! How's your head? Well, I've never had any complaints.